Hello, thank you for being with us. Welcome to Nova News Network. Did you know that ex-President Trump claimed to be pro-law enforcement to win his first term in office? Well, this is how it went. Several individuals who worked for the Trump administration faced legal issues or were charged with crimes. For example, Michael Flynn, former National Security Advisor, pleaded guilty to lying to the FBI about his communications with Russian officials during the transition period before Trump took office. However, he was later pardoned by Trump. Paul Manafort, former campaign chairman, was convicted of tax evasion and bank fraud. He was sentenced to prison but was later released to home confinement due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Trump also pardoned Manafort. Roger Stone, former political advisor, was convicted of witness tampering, obstruction of justice, and making false statements to Congress in connection with the investigation into Russian interference in the 2016 election. He was sentenced to prison but was later commuted by Trump. These are just a few examples, and there were other individuals associated with the Trump administration who faced legal scrutiny or charges during their tenure or afterward. Trump's lawyers are also facing trouble with the law. Eastman and Clark, three additional attorneys who worked for Trump in 2020, Sidney Powell, Kenneth Casebro, and Jenna Ellis, have pleaded guilty to criminal charges in Georgia, potentially jeopardizing their law licenses. So, there you go. Thank you for watching. Leave us a message and let us know your thoughts. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time.